project described as a liquid mirror telescope. It's a reflector telescope uh, which uses a liquid, a reflecting liquid as its primary concave mirror and has been used uh, previously for the past 100 years or so but it's been popularized recent, recently. The liquid mirror telescope comes in a range of uh, diameter of 1 meter uh, which is quite huge compared to other telescopes. The basic principle involved here is that uh, liquid, uh, when rotated at some angular velocity, produces a parabola. This can be derived from Newton's laws and the uh, focal length for the parabola uh, depends on the angular velocity and the acceleration due to gravity. We use, a, uh, we use as a reflecting liquid mercury because it's, uh, found, it's very common and has a high reflectivity of the order of 70% or 90% uh, depending on the purity. For a liquid mirror telescope, here we have used a Bakelite disc as the basic structure which is mounted on a motor which is a synchronous motor which is a synchronous motor which rotates at a, the proper angular velocity required to uh, keep the focal length at 2 meters. The basic principle is that we have used a very large tel uh, telescope diameter that allows us to uh, accumulate that as much light as possible and this gives a much brighter image than the other, other conventional telescopes. Uh, the We have reduced the amount of volume that of mercury that will be required by using a resin known as polyurethane. Uh, we'll, we have rotated the uh, Bakelite disc at uh, required angular velocity which gives us a, a near parabolic uh, resin formation over which a, a minor thickness of 1, one mm mercury comes which has a very low weight of uh, let's say around 13 kgs which is equivalent to 1 litre of mercury. Uh, this is one of a kind in India with only two or three proper liquid mirror telescopes uh, functioning in India. Uh, the one has been, uh, the one that has been developed in Uttarakhand is the largest and is uh, and has a collaboration with some foreign universities. Uh, so this will be one of a kind and is not found anywhere else in India.